<clears throat> okay, um, so you're probably, like, very confused about this website right now, um, I think I made this website w back, like, when I first broke my leg, um, I'll probably have to check, but, um, prob I'd have to say, yeah, before, like, not well before, but yeah, before the whole schizo post thing happened. The whole schizo post thing. Um, but, um, before this whole thing, you know, I was in bed, you know, the death of my dad and everything, like me having all these questions. Um, I kind of created this cult, like, cult website, um, um, it's called Finet. Um, now, um, um, Fi, if you didn't know, is actually, like, the schizopose symbol, but, of course, you know, they have two different meanings, um, this is, um, the Boltzmann Omega symbol, um, there's, you know, a bit of a story behind, well, what's this thing doing, I don't know, um, there's a bit of a story behind that, and that has to do with this, which I might go on to, because, um, it's not really spoilers for anything, because it's an outdated story, it's not canon, um, so, um, though, it, it is true that all things are in the set of Baltimore Omega, there's, you know, stuff like that, um, so, before, um, so, you know, like, the earlier schizo posts, they, they they had to, like, um, see, I forget the word, but, um, they had the, like, style of rainbows converging into white light, but now, they have the whole, theme of, um, white light can, like, diverging into rainbows, um, but that, you know, whatever, that's probably not important, um, so, the creepy thing about this is, when, you know, Google Meets back then when school was virtual, I would go on there, and I would, like, put this through Base64 and literally paste it in there as soon as I left, and, you know, hopes, also, congratulations on cracking the code of this link, and then everyone at school, if they found this, they would think I'm some kind of actual schizophrenic, like, um, well, anyways, um, this isn't really important, this stuff, um, it's just, um, stuff about my binary numbers, you know, that's not important to this at all, um, Uma Cypher, yeah, well, and here's where it gets creepy. Zero point energy is the energy produced by zero virtual particles. That part's true. Which are particles that pop in and out of existence. True. Are defined as random fluctuations in space. That's also true. They happen so they have to have energy. That's somewhat true. There's an infinite amount of ZP in any given volume. Now this is um kind of a controversy in the science community. I think it's called like the vacuum catastrophe or something. Is it infinite? Is it finite but arbitrarily large? Or is it arbitrarily small? That's a question that still hasn't been answered. If we could harness that, of course, you know, we'd be the humans would be set forever. Um, however, they do not have a defined size or location, which yeah, that's actually true with uncertainty principle. Um, it's complicated that, you know, that's probably really important for, like, perpetual motion. Um, <clears throat> so to harness this energy, um, you need a force, no size. Yeah. Before the universe, there was ZP particles. That hasn't been, that's just Big Bang Theory, that's not, like, universe canon um whatever but no energy and somehow matter appears now i think i've made it clear um through my theories that i've been laced into these schizo posts something called nihil instability which is supposedly that nothing is unstable which is true it's probably been proven by the scientists um that you know like when you have nothing it becomes unstable and that's what created the universe which is a completely acceptable explanation for why anything exists um, but no energy, and then somehow matter appears. Though, so Megan, for see, this is where I completely go off the rails. I go into science fiction. I'm like L. Ron Hubbard writing the book, whatever that book was called, and the whole Scientology thing. I'm basically remaking Scientology here, and I realized that, and I didn't stop. The Megan Force is the only way to do that. Is that some kind of like body thetan thing? Or, like e m whatever the e meter or whatever um particles like 
quarks and neutrinos are not made up of other particles. That's plausible. It's not confirmed, though. Um, they're made up of the energy of <clears throat> the quantum field. That's true, which gives them a little no mass. You know. Therefore, zero-point energy can be manipulated to create matter. That's probably true. <clears throat> now, this gets a little... Now, this, the, the train is not only derailed, but it's gone back in time to back when um that whole manhole explosion thing happened with the nuclear bomb the train went on top of the manhole and now it's in space um so this whole thing about Boltzmann and Shadowman some some kind of Boltzmann integration Shadowman integration with the phi symbol back on the schizo post and the universe is destroyed and this is this is literally me copying Scientology right now. Cutie Caterpillar is science fiction. Now, of course, the old Cutie Caterpillar story. But look at this. There's no... Okay. Um, I was going completely insane here about this theory about how... Um, oh, look. Oh, that's... Oh, that's not... Specific. Um, a species represented by a crystal that plants seeds in the ground and creates more of them. Hmm, where have I seen that before? Hmm, a, uh, some four diamonds conquering the galaxy with some kind of uh, whatever. You know what I'm talking about. Um, its appearance is perfectly centered around itself. It looks how it wants to. Um, now that's not. Now that has nothing to do with this, but that's important. Um, glyph. Um, see, this is basically just me copying Steven Universe because it, uh, the gems are basically their brain. Like if it's broken, they're like they don't work anymore. Glyph would be that's new. Um, don't have a marriage system condemning anything exclusive. Now, yes, nothing should be exclusive, but condemning marriage and my whole thing with that is oh if you cheat on someone that's bad um i don't know but um <clears throat> they don't have noses or ears that was a design choice i thought they were ugly with I'll, I'll probably show you what this omega human looked like it's it's like this old design that's like completely unproportional and it has really big eyes like the old kitty caterpillar eyes but um they can hear with their whole body okay so what um up they can't taste with their whole body um they can't uh, well you know why why shouldn't like you know that's okay they don't have bones like you would assume the like a mega human picture i have doesn't have bones get their food from purely now this is actually a cool concept purely materialized like sch schizomatic meat um that's something that's still like in like the newer key caterpillar store that i'm developing um animals aren't legal because you know they're perfect they're paragons you know, paragons are all the same. No, there's um something called um. Per oh, never mind. <clears throat> the universe in the eyes of psi net power. Here we go. Oh, I forgot to change this one time. Oh, that's not psi. That's phi. I got it wrong. Um, and it was billions of years ago. A god created this universe. I was in church back then. That's why I use the word god. Not that I don't believe in God because. I probably do, but, you know, the whole uh, Bible reference with capitalizing the word God, um, but something went wrong. The God become unbalanced. Now, this is the complete opposite of nylon stability. This is like, okay, if there is a God, why did it split? If a God is perfect, then why did this God split into a good God and a bad God? Because of this, life isn't how it should to be. This is the rewrite of the Bible. This is saying, oh, hey, come here, eat the apple, um, um, oh no, we split in two. Um, God bless us with the power of force. Now, this is, you know, reminds me of the whole Meridian, the Chinese ancient, um, uh, medicine thing with the, um, with the, uh, chi force, you know, might be real, who knows, probably schizo. Um, a Megan force, supposedly a sixth force that... Okay, so I had this whole thing where there was six forces, the gravity, um, strong, weak nuclear forces, and um, electromagnetic. And then I took love. You know what love does? It fuses things. It takes the two bodies and it fuses them, like in that funny show with the crystal gems, and they fuse and they come big. Um, if you know my old Reddit account, you know how crazy I went on that. Um, 
Well, anyways, it, it, you know, human brain is like a computer, but there's more to it. Because they have souls, and they can love. Because you can't convince me that our emotions are just chemicals. Because what tells the chemicals what to do? There is nothing you can explain that says nothing in the universe can simulate feelings like, like a conscious being can. That's just proof right there that souls exist. Um, so when something goes wrong, no. Now this, I'm not even going to go into this line right here. It has something to do with like um, like how um special needs people's brains work and how you can't fix it because some kind of rewire happened <clears throat> and you can't fix it and that there's a balance system that's something like because people to the left are the special needs ones people to the right are like some kind of i don't know it only gets worse from here um we can't use that hidden power what are you gonna do now your hair turns blue your leaves start coming out of it and whatever you know um, what? Oh, here we go. Um, uh oh, one race, one gender, because there's no diversity. You know, the gears t turn and build whatever. Um, <clears throat> oh, but you don't have any emotions. You're being basically simulation. Now, I don't know about you all, but I wouldn't want to live like that. I wouldn't want to live with a helmet on my head, um... And sitting in this chair, like, you know, like, the people in Wally, like, you know, they obviously have not had exercise in years, um, but, you know, that, like that, but worse, um, so, you know, that's kind of wholesome, ha ha ha, so, um, I made a story called Kitty Cat for the Falls of Order Boltzmann, it starts on the Boltzmann takes full of the men and okay, this is kind of, um, spoiler words, um, I shouldn't be showing this, but... <laughs> It's not spoilers, it's kind of old, like two years old. Um, one year, actually, yeah, somewhere around there. <sighs> okay, yes. Now, it's not exactly, um, just, you know, kind of, um, 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 whatever. Um, some of this is outdated, um, a lot of it is. Um, I'll finish this later. Um, so yeah, um, Elrond Schizo, um, Infinity, um, oh, here we go with this. Now, this makes absolutely no sense, but, so you know those videos on YouTube, like, the BFB videos with the editing of logos and everything? This is, like, extremely linked to this, and it's very weird, and it's just old me going crazy with these theories about balance, and... Just don't, like, don't, it, it, this is what happens when you research what, what is, what, whatever it's called, the S from hell or whatever. Don't, like, I research this, and uh, haha, um, oh, huh, um, this probably has something to do with an ancient force of these two gods splitting, because I can think whatever I want, I have a broken leg, um, you think life isn't fair, who doesn't? Who doesn't uh, have power? Power other uh, power over others, no, but power, you know, that's cool. Um, extra instancy in ology. That's a new word I made up. Finding new colors, you know, I like to do that. You know, finding this, that, this, that. You believe in equality, who doesn't? Um, I hope you do. But anyways, that's fine that, the, um, the, um, the, like, um, <coughs> digital integration of my old self into the internet probably means and means to corrupt it um but yeah that's that's like this is like the prequel to schizo post it's like worse um that's off